could have a buy now type call to action mixed with a, um, a subscribe. You could just bury in there. So that, like you said, if they're not quite ready to pull the trigger right then, but they like what they see, then they're gonna get maybe a regular email or they're gonna um, get more videos. And then that takes them further, then you have multiple opportunities uh, to say if you sell multiple products or like for coupon sites, it's great. Because, or the, not, not but like daily deal, daily deal, what is it, like deal of the day type sites, um, where you could be, every day they could get a new list of the things that are on sale that day until finally something interests them. They're like, oh, I want that, click. Um, there's, uh, you can use the old, uh, it's very kind of cheesy, but the limited time offer type thing. Um, in that case, you're probably not gonna wanna put, it's a quite slight, slight sidestep, but you might not wanna put too much budget into a video like that. You might wanna think about lower cost video production choices if it's something where it's a limited time offer, unless you're just always gonna use that video, just always say it's a limited time offer, assuming that once someone buys it, they're probably not gonna watch the video again and not care. It's kind of like when you drive down the freeway and you see those buildings, Um, so another sorry um, man I just I just lost you there for a second uh, uh, so the, yeah, yeah, it froze up the screen uh, for some reason we don't have a good reception um, I checked my, my internet speed before I jumped on the code call and we were 50 up and 50 down um, so it, I feel like we should be right on my side unless they're I don't know, playing with something now. Um, but you got up to the point, right? It's like driving down the highway. And oh, yeah. You just froze. So should we just take it from there? Sure. Cool. Sure. I was, uh, I was just kind of uh, I was, I was saying that you could, uh, if you're doing like a limited time offer uh, video, you could um, maybe spend less on the video because you're only going to use it for a short period of time unless you wanted to just, always say that it's a limited time offer. Kind of like when you're driving down the freeway and you see those big signs that say going out of business, uh, closing, clearance, everything must go. And then you drive down six months later and the same store is still there with the same sign that says closing, clearance, everything must go. So they, they just don't care. So you could actually make a video that just says limited time offer. I've seen them on TV actually with those limited time offer. You, the first six callers get the discount. And then a week later or the next day, you stay the same exact ad. First six callers get the discount. So either nobody got the discount yet or they're just always doing that and that's just their, their gimmick. Um, another would be a, uh, to, to ask someone to share the video. Um, that, that is just a, that's really good for awareness type. Uh, a lot of times, like going back to the example of Pizza Hut or um, when there's a new product launch, uh, especially on the brand side or even even startups and businesses that they have a new product or services new uh, product or service launching uh, They might just want to let people know so uh, to get people to share the video to actually overtly get come out and say it share this video um, What that'll do too is a lot of times someone will watch a video. This is a really important point um, you, you your video may be targeting a certain buyer persona a certain audience but it may get watched by somebody who really isn't your target, but they like the video and they know somebody who is. 